Hi, my name is Leslie Strauss. I'm part of the Learning and Engagement team at the Mint Museum. In this video, you'll learn how to make your own vivid color scratch art paper. You can cut the paper down and turn it into art for handmade note cards, or even cut it into shapes and give it to a friend as a DIY scratch art gift. Today you're going to need dish soap, tempera paint, I'm using black tempera paint, crayons, a paintbrush, a cup that I don't mind getting messy, measuring spoon, paper towels for a mess, and white paper. And this is really just a printer paper, so this will work just fine for this project. I also have some drawing paper that I may try to use. The important thing with your paper is that it has a really smooth surface. All right, that's everything you need to make your own scratch art paper. Let's go ahead and get started. Start by covering the entire surface of your paper with crayon. Use bright colors that contrast or are different than your paint color. You'll need to press hard to get a thick crayon layer. That waxy surface is what makes the project work. Your hand may get a little tired, that's okay, just shake it off. Make sure that every little white space is filled with color. You can fill your spaces randomly, like I did, or you can even create patterns. Next, you'll mix the tempera paint and dish soap at a 2 to 1 ratio. Add 1 tablespoon of dish soap to your cup. Add 2 tablespoons of tempera paint. Mix them together really well with your paintbrush. Now that my paint's ready, I'm going to cover my crayon drawing. I'll apply a thin layer of paint to the entire surface of the drawing. Once I finish covering it, I'll set it aside to dry. When it's dry, I'm going to add a second coat of the black paint and let it dry once more before scratching. Next, you're going to need a wooden skewer, or you could use a toothpick, and you're also going to need a clean, dry brush. Use the skewer or toothpick to scratch designs into your scratch art paper. You won't need a pencil, and you're not going to be able to erase, so just go with the designs that happen. I'm doing a geometric tree, and I'm going to fill the whole surface with a lot of different patterns. As you scratch away, it's kind of like a discovery, finding what color is underneath, so it's really fun to try to fill the entire page with designs. Your clean paintbrush comes in handy to brush away any of the scratched off paint. You may notice that I'm working on a smaller square now. That's because after my larger square was dry, I cut it into four squares so I could use them on cards. You can choose to do a large image or cut it into smaller ones. It's totally up to you. This colorful scratch art project was inspired by works of art on view in the exhibition In Vivid Color at Mint Museum Uptown. Even if you can't go in person to a museum to see the artwork, you should check it out online. In Vivid Color has some really cool videos to watch and great images of the artwork. See if you can find some inspiration in the things you see in this exhibition. Thanks for checking out our Vivid Color Scratch Art Project. Find more art project ideas at Museum From Home on the Mint Museum's website.